You know, when I first heard about the butter snitching stuff, I didn't want to believe it for the fact that, you know, he was rolling with K.I., Lil B and them. Just off that, I didn't want to believe it. You know, because I'm like, damn, you know, Lil B and K.I. is like the people who I did the most videos about. So for Butter to be a snitch, it was like disappointing. How you hanging with, you know, the two people that I believe was putting in a lot of work and, you know, that really stood out from the rest of the guys. But yeah, you snitching. But most people was calling him a snitch. But I was trying not to believe it. But anyway, Lou J spoke about that in the interview as well. He said it's true, 100% true. He said he had the paperwork coming. He had paperwork on different stuff, not just that. You know, I think it's even other stuff he was saying that Butter was doing. But he said he definitely snitched on him. That's why Butter was eating, you know, that food they gave him in that picture. He had like a good food that they don't give to prisoners. I guess he said some kind of Italian meat or something with Pepsi and sound like he was eating good. You know, because they take care of informants, allegedly. Because I wasn't there, but Lou J said he did snitch. Not only that, he said he got Lou J's mother locked up. She did like three years. So not only did he snitch on Lou J and got him the seven, he got his mom's the three. But it's crazy the fact that his mother had to go down because of that, because of butter snitching. That's crazy. Because usually, they just keep it in the streets. They don't get the parents involved. So for butter to do that, if it's true, get his mother locked up for three years... You see why Lou J is mad. He's angry at a lot of stuff. He said he changed. He's not being nice to nobody no more. He said Yella, you know, try to holler at him or try to text him or call him. He said he's not messing with nobody because when he was locked up, nobody took care of him. So he's not going to do nothing with nobody. Because it seemed like they want to do music with him because they know when you come home, your music is going to go up. Because everybody want to hear what you got to say. You're going to get views and make money. So it look like they clout chasing there are some artists who going to want to get on tracks with him because that's going to help their career. But like Lou J said, nobody cared when he was locked up, so he's not really messed with nobody. 